Hi everyone, meteorologist Matt Gray. A big change for the second half of the weekend as a snowstorm moves into the area. We're looking at about one to three inches across the valleys of the inland northwest. Slightly cool temperatures by late February and early March standards and it's one of three snow systems that we're going to be tracking in the week ahead. Temperatures overnight will be well into the snow zone. We'll be down into the mid-20s, low 30s in a couple of spots around the region. And as we go through the day, expect most of the snow to fall in the morning through about lunchtime. We'll see some very isolated snow showers in the afternoon. It'll be breezy throughout the day as well, so we could see some blowing and drifting snow in places like the Palouse and across the Columbia Basin. Our highs will help melt some of that snow that falls in the morning. Temperatures only be up into the mid-30s see some spots in the 40s like Moses Lake. You can see generally the higher in elevation you go, the better chance you're going to have for some of that snow. Sandpoint likely going to be one of the areas that sees the most snowfall around Spokane and Coeur d'Alene. Most of us seeing one to two inches. Some of those higher benches will get up into that three inch range. One of the least snowy places, Moses Lake and OMAC. As we go through this week, System number two shows up late Monday and goes through early in the day on Tuesday. We get another break on Wednesday, and storm number three comes in on Thursday. There's a potential for some of that snow to linger on into Friday. Overall, temperatures as we enter the month of March coming in a little bit below where they would normally be at this time of the year. And that will certainly allow for some more snow accumulations and some sloppy travel as we go through this upcoming week.